Word has a useful feature that allows you to see what your printed output will look like before you actually print. This feature, called Print Preview, is explored in this quick tip. The Print Preview feature of Word is helpful because it allows you to review what you are going to print to make sure it is correct. This can also help you avoid wasting paper on failed printing attempts. Print Preview kicks into gear automatically when you choose to print. Press Ctrl P, you can see the Print Preview area on the screen. The preview of your document differs from the other viewing modes of Word in that it shows an exact representation of what your printed output will look like. This means that if you have multiple printer drivers installed, you can change the target printer and Word will regenerate the print preview to show what the printout will look like on the target printer. Print preview also includes several controls which you can see around the view. You can move around the print preview by clicking on the page number control down here near the bottom. All we have to do is click through or click back and we can choose which page of our printout that we want to see in the print preview. You can also view your document closer by using the zoom slider at the bottom right hand corner of this uh, screen so that you can see what it looks like up close or when you make it smaller it'll show you multiple pages on the screen at the same time. When you are satisfied with what is shown in print preview just click the print button to actually print the document. If you decide that you don't want to print your document you can exit by using one of two methods. You can either press the escape key or you can click on the back arrow up in the upper left hand corner of the screen. I'm going to go ahead and press the escape key and we're back to our actual document. If you found this quick tip helpful, be sure to click the subscribe button and then the bell icon. That way YouTube will keep you informed when I add any more videos to the WordTips channel. Thanks for spending a few moments with me today.